Hi, g'day, this is Paul from Solace. I'm going to be continuing on on the inverter troubleshooting series. Today I'm going to be talking about meter SLT fail, and it stands for in full meter select fail. So effectively, this inverter needs to know what meter it's speaking to for it to grab the data correctly, and we just need to select on the inverter the correct meter. So firstly, I'm gonna show us how to find and see where this alarm code is showing. On the home screen, you find it on the top left-hand side. It says meter select fail under grid status. And the other place you can find it is in menu, advanced information, press enter, you go to alarm message, you press enter, and you got at the top there, you got a meter select fail with a date timestamp. To get out of that, you press escape, press escape again and then you've got that basic menu that, that all our products start with and then you go to advanced settings to select the meters. I'm going through how to select the meter now. Type in the code, down, down, up, enter. Then you go to storage energy set. You scroll down to storage energy set until it's white. Press enter. Then you go through to meter select. So you would press down to go to that. I was luckily there already. Meter select meter set and then meter select, apologies. And then you go to, you, it's dependent on what meter I have. So uh, we've got an acryl meter connected through to this meter. And we, that was the, the general meter set up with this inverter and it got the name single phase meter. So with an acryl meter, you would select single phase meter. If I had to press enter here, it would fix the alarm code. It doesn't always fix it instantly. Um, you just got to give it some time. And I've had it, cases where I've had to give it a hard reset to fix it, but it, it does fix it when you give it the correct meter to select. And then if obviously if you have the different types of meters, you can go through them all. Um, there's, there's the Eastron, which is what we're shipping with these inverters nowadays, and you would select that meter if you wanted to. Always make sure you press enter on the screen and don't just look at the screen. You must always, even if you're happy that you've got the correct meter selected, just press enter and it will say done. It, it, it saves it into a memory and it's happy.